Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how I dye my wigs and bleach the knots on them. This hair is from Jerly She Hair. I will have all the hair details linked down below in the description box for you guys. So starting off, I'm using the Revlon Color Silk Hair Dye. I use soft black or black. Um, it doesn't really matter. I just pick up whichever one is in stock in store. Um, and I do use two boxes. Normally, whenever I dye, I always use two boxes. Two boxes is always enough, even if the hair is like a different density, two boxes always seems to work for me. So um, I just start off by sectioning the wig like you would do your real hair, just section it off and I work my way up. I do apply the hair dye with a brush because I feel that it's easier than using the um, little squeeze bottle that comes with. And also with the squeeze bottle, you can risk getting it on the lace. Now, some people do use the water method, watercolor method whenever they dye their wigs, but I just feel like, I mean, I used to do it, but I feel like every time I did it, it would tint the lace and using black, it would kind of turn the lace like a greenish bluish tone. So I just decided to do it the old way and that's the way that I get the best results. Um, it's really quick. It probably takes me like 30 minutes to do this. So that's just the way that I do it. Um, I think the rest is pretty um, self-explanatory I do not do the frontal um, hair until like last I section that off and I do that all at once together because you want to be really tedious with the frontal area so you're not getting any dye on the lace and don't be afraid to dye the hairs on the frontal because it's really really easy I promise you um, if I do end up getting a little dye on the lace if it like seeps through it's totally fine it washes off it's not really noticeable as long as you're not getting it on the hairline area so be really careful when you do the hairline area um i think that's pretty much it that i do i'll let you guys watch how i dye it and then i'll come back whenever i'm applying the bleach to the knots Down for you always. And I'm down for you. 
Okay, so now it's time to dye. I do use the Wella Powder Lightener and the Salon Care 30 Volume Developer. I prefer 30 Volume Developer because it processes like just the right amount. 20 is pretty slow, 40 is too fast, and sometimes I forget that my knots are bleaching, so 30 is perfect for me. It takes about 20 minutes for my knots to bleach, depending on like the hair. If it's like the little double knot, it's gonna take a while. I may have to like bleach it twice. I actually had to bleach this one twice because the knots were pretty big and they were being pretty stubborn. And whenever it's like a single knot, super easy. They could probably bleach in like 15 minutes. So I like my bleach to be kind of runny so that it can seep through especially since this is double knotted I want it to kind of seep through and really gather around those knots and bleach them so that's why I like mine a little running if the knots are single I will make the bleach mixture a little bit thicker but most of the time I like it a little bit runny I'm gonna have these products linked below this is all I use to bleach the knots on my wig I don't use any other type of bleach this is what I like this is what I stick to these work well together I get them from Sally's and I will have those down below I'm gonna make sure I remember to put that down below because I always forget but now I'm just installing the wig it's pretty self-explanatory once again you guys have probably seen me install wigs millions of times so I'm gonna let this just play out and I guess I'll be back when I'm done
I'm outside in an AMG, right outside, TT, two turn baby girl, you know me, still with the dolls that I grew beside, all the niggas brown, I let it die, gotta watch the time cause it's flying right by, I'm outside in an AMG, right outside, TT, two turn baby girl, you know me, Caught a shorty off a fence, dog. Just the one I'm really is a great shot. Way that I've been living, I'm conventional. I'm just trying to make it to the end, you know. Certain things have started getting pissed off. Think we need to have a sun adventure. I could be a man, but maybe down the road. Right now, I would love to see my heart turn to bone. Rather see my heart turn crystal. Inside a crib on my own Soon as I freeze up, I'm about to pop up on your phone Like, I'm outside in an AMG Right outside, PT Two-turn, baby girl, you know me Okay, you guys, so this is going to be the end of the video. I'm just going in and adding a little bit more definition to the front of the hair because it seemed like the wave kind of got lost. I feel like this has to be like some type of loose wave because this isn't really like deep wave to me, but I'm not sure I'll have the correct um, hair description, hair details in the description box, but I really do like this pattern though because I feel like really curly patterns just don't fit my face right especially when they're long like shorter curly patterns fit but not the long ones so i actually like this it's kind of like wavy and beachy but yeah i really do like it also this wig is going to be up for sale on my depop so if you were interested in it i would hurry and go to my depop i'll have it linked below for you guys and i just want to thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for subscribing don't forget to like comment subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.